over one million dollars in two phantoms right here both of these cars are worth nearly six hundred thousand dollars this black phantom right here is brand new customer just got it wanted it fully protected so we did a full paint protection film all over the car now it's protected from you know scratches door dents all that kind of stuff scrapes whatever gotta protect this beast stock wheels we did smoke the reflectors on this guy so reflectors are smoked he didn't want to go too crazy on it still wants to be classy but have a little look to it we also did 20 percent tints all around looks really good on this black phantom 8 right next to it another phantom 8 this guy was fully wrapped by us previously as you can see it's got a pro white wrap on the sides and a gloss black going through the top also looks incredible this guy was also tinted this one features 24 inch mansory wheels that we did a while back with some beefy tires so that looks great rides great these things are boss cars right here normally these things would be rentals because they're so expensive but these are both customer owned vehicles trusted by the customers with RDB of course Alright guys, we're in front of this brand new G63. This is a really, really dope color. It's like a forest green metallic color. Right now we have some temporary wheels on it. These are actually from another G63, but he has the same wheels. We are actually powder coating these in gloss black. They are back from powder coat, so we're gonna throw them on right now and show you guys. For now, that's it on this guy, more to come. But let's touch bases on what we talked about in another episode, which is these headlights getting stolen. What's funny is uh, Beverly Hills PD police department just posted that they caught two guys um, stealing these headlights. Not this particular car, but other G-Wagons. Um, they caught them at their house with like eight sets of these, all kinds of Mercedes parts. They did a task force and found these guys, which is crazy right when we released that video about these things, they caught them. So really crazy stuff. Hopefully it's the last we'll be hearing about these things getting stolen because they're very expensive and annoying to deal with. So um, yeah, good job Beverly Hills PD. We're not yeah, talking I mean. about wars and stuff right now. Okay, okay. Yeah, just cars. Yeah, cars. Yeah, cars. Car, yeah. car, yeah. so this, this is Lamborghini's first SUV. Number one. The first one. First one. Wow. Yeah, it's beautiful kind of, car. Do you want to feel how fast it is? No, 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 no. <laughs> okay. No. So fast! It's not that fast. Uh-huh. Oh, oh, oh. Kidnap! <laughs> <laughs> kidnap! I have no money, man. Don't kidnap me. Tell us. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about this car? Car is beautiful, but I'm kidnapped with all I have no money. Yeah, you do. You have $20. But they're nothing. What happened to your hat? 
I lost it. <laughs> what? I'm <laughs> being a fool out of it. <laughs> Gotta be the heaviest jumper in the world. All right. Hold on, hold on. What the hell are you doing? A full long kernel, I tell you. She's still not done. There's a lot of work on this car still. We're not done yet. We still have mechanical stuff we gotta do. Um, but it's getting there. It's looking good. Yeah! It's running! It's nice. It sounds good. We still got work to do though. Let's take it inside the shop and get this thing going. We just got a page on the speaker uh, stating that there's a few fans inside. Let's go say hi. They came from really far away, so let's. What the hell are you doing, Sarkis? I kind of scratched it. The mirror. I mean, yeah, the mirror is completely broken. What are you trying to, trying to do? Uh, I think it's out of the place. It's definitely not out of place. The whole thing is broken. I think if you glue it. The tape is not going to hold that. If the owner sees you doing that, we're all going to die. In mm. two seconds. I think this is a problem with That's Lamborghini. Not this is not us. It's a yeah, problem with Lamborghini. I like the fact that you have yellow tape. You put yellow tape so nobody can tell. Is that what you're trying to do? Yellow Kinda. tape, match the paint of the car. Nice. It's not gonna work. We have fans from Sacramento. I'm um, here to just check out the cars. Lots of merch too, that's pretty cool. Sacramento, man, I, I watch all the RDB videos. This place is crazy. It's just as crazy in real life as it is over the videos. And thank you for having me. This place, oh. is, this place is awesome, man. I love it. Rolls-Royce Wraith, we've done a lot of these, you guys already know. This one has a full blackout. Specifically, we painted the window moldings. These things have big window moldings. Most of the time, we do everything with a wrap. However, this one, we painted. Big pain in the butt taking those off and putting back on, but uh, this customer is a little picky. Anytime you wrap those moldings, no matter who it is, those edges, it's tough. It's gonna eventually start peeling. So we went ahead, we painted that for him. Also, it's been lowered on 24 inch wheels. These are one piece, crazy, crazy wheels. Um, as you guys can see, it it's straight spoke and it has many, many spokes. I don't want to count how many there are, but definitely a lot of spokes. Looks really cool on this thing. Obviously floating cap in the middle. So the RR is still the stock cap. It looks amazing and classy at the same time. Uh, the lowering feature on it, obviously we have it right now in the slammed mode, slammed position, so you guys can see it in all its glory. When you drive it goes up and it retains all factory air suspension usage, so that's all good. That's a simple black Rolls Royce with some really awesome wheels and it uh, looks great, so uh, on to the next one. This thing also has a beautiful interior, it has this dark red color. 
um, with the ostrich on the side, starlet on the top. So it's a really nice configuration. This is a really, really nice wraith. Um, if I were to do one for myself, this would be very similar. A lot of variety at the shop right now from that convertible G-Wagon that's a full paint job, full-blown custom interior, full-blown custom metalwork. So it's, it's a lot of work. We have a bunch of wraps, we have a clear bras and phantoms, 2020 Supra, um, color change wraps, of course, as usual. Reminder, we're not a wrap shop. Um, obviously, there's a ton of shops out there that just do wraps. Um, we're not one of those. We've been doing wraps for a very long time. We did some crazy wraps back in the day nobody's done before. Um, lots of innovative wrap stuff as well. But at the same time, we've been a body shop before. So paint work, all that stuff was even before these wraps. My business partner is, his father has been doing this for about 40 years now. So he, he's well, well experienced. So we added all that aspect together and that's kind of how it went on. We also introduced mechanical work about eight years ago. So we've been doing mechanical work, servicing exotic cars, Ferraris, Lambos, Rolls Royce, whatever it is. We do the brakes, we do oil changes, heavier stuff. Uh, we recently changed power steering on a Murcielago. So all this stuff we do in-house. We have all the factory computers for scanning, resetting, diagnosing, diagnostics, all that stuff. So we do all of that. So whether it's a wrap, wheels, tires, crazy custom work, paint work, accidents, which we work with all insurance companies, could do that too. I don't wanna make this sound like a pitch too much, but it's, it's very uh, crazy what we do, all this in one. 95% of shops don't do all of this in one, they do one or two aspects of it. So that's what kind of keeps us going as well. It's very, very hard labor and a lot of hard work. I'm at the shop pretty much six days out of the week. So we're back at the shop now from our little short drive, but uh, yeah, so. Whatever you guys are doing, keep at it, hard work, and you'll get all this and more.